Welcome back to Quantum Yogi Wisdom. 1111 portal is opening. In this video, I'm about to reveal why the 11th of November holds the key to shifting your identity and manifesting your desires very, very fast. I'll also share with you a powerful ritual to do on this day to attract massive wealth, health, and success into your life. But before we get started, if you enjoy content on spirituality, manifestation, and self-discovery, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. Have you ever wondered why people close their eyes and make a wish when the clock strikes 11-11? Do you find yourself doing it too, without really knowing why? Let me know in the comment. 11 is a very auspicious number across many ancient cultures and numerology. This number represents both our earthly and spiritual realms. Much like needing someone's phone number to connect via a call, the 1111 portal acts as our cosmic dial number. On 1111, with certain rituals which I'm about to share in this video, it's as though we're dialing into the universe, sharing our deepest desires to manifest. It's as if the network is really, really strong on the day of 1111, where the universe can listen to our intentions and desires very clearly. This is why 1111 is called as the angel number, because it connects you with higher universal energies. Now pay very close attention. The number 11 is not just considered auspicious across various ancient cultures, but it also connects you with the higher universal energies. The number 11 is symbolic in both our earthly realm and the universal realm. This is why many who engage in spiritual practices or manifestation often notice frequent occurrences of 1111, seeing it as a significant and guiding synchronicity. Synchronicities are the channels through which archangels and higher energies guide us, often labeled as coincidences. These can manifest through various forms such as recurring song lyrics, repetitive number sightings, or receiving unexpected messages from someone you were recently contemplating. These occurrences carry symbolic messages or guidance from the spiritual realm. Let me know in the comments if you see 1111 very often. Everything in this universe vibrates at a particular frequency. From the smallest subatomic particles to the grandeur of galaxies, everything resonates with a unique frequency. This isn't just a spiritual notion, it aligns with scientific principles too. Energy, in its various forms, can be described in terms of waves and oscillations, manifesting as frequencies. Frequencies, you see, are measured in numbers. Numbers aren't just abstract symbols, they play a crucial role in understanding the very fabric of reality. It's a fascinating dance where mathematics meets the mystical. In numerology, the number one is a symbol for the unity of all things. It is the ultimate angel number because it is the beginning of everything, the start of something new. Number one is the number of creations, representing oneness with the divine, the spark of all life, and new endeavors. 1111 is an alert from the angelic energies that you are supported by forces you cannot see. You can sink into relief, celebrate, and get excited when you see 1111. It gives you confirmation that everything is on schedule and divinely guided in your world at this time. The number 1111 is a number of alignment of the highest order. The number one, numerologically, is considered God's number. It's a representation of the singularity of everything that lives, that it is all one and the same, and it signifies the harmony of that fact. The number one is the highest number, energetically, in numerology. When repeated, like 1111, it amplifies the energy of the one. This tells you not just to get in alignment, but that you're already there. 1111. Portal is one of the communication mediums between you and the higher universal energies. During this time, the boundary between the spiritual and material realms is less distinct, making it an opportune time for manifestation. This is when you tell the universe your deepest desires and show gratitude so that you can attract more into your physical reality. The 1111 portal is like one of the cosmic holidays we can use it for our benefit by setting our intention and releasing it to the universe. As the 1111 portal draws near, many of us will begin to notice some remarkable shifts in our energy and perception. You might feel your intuition heighten, your psychic abilities sharpen, or even experience dreams that feel more vivid and meaningful. It's like the veil between the physical and spiritual realms becomes thinner, and messages from your higher self or other positive forces start to come through more clearly. Those of you who meditate regularly or are on a spiritual path might begin to notice synchronicities popping up in your life. Those little coincidences, 
that feel too perfect to ignore. This is the universe reaching out, trying to communicate with you, guiding you to awaken to the deeper truths within you. If you're aware, you'll marvel at how everything seems to align effortlessly around you. But if you're not conscious of it, well, it's time to wake up. When you become aware of your unconscious actions and thoughts, you begin to see the magic unfolding around you. Suddenly, everything feels more interconnected, as if the universe is speaking directly to you, helping you grow and evolve. Now, with the 1111 portal comes a special opportunity to manifest your desires at lightning speed. Your thoughts, feelings, and intentions on this day are like frequencies being broadcasted out into the cosmos. The universe amplifies whatever energy you put out there, so it's crucial to be mindful of your emotional state. If you're feeling sadness, for instance, the higher forces might interpret that as your desire and in turn, manifest more of it into your reality. Likewise, if you're feeling abundant and joyful, expect the universe to mirror that back to you with even more abundance. The key here is awareness. When you're feeling negative emotions like sadness, fear, or doubt, you're essentially putting out a thought infused with those low vibrations. This thought then gets magnified, attracting more situations that mirror that same energy. And we don't want that, do we? So it's vital to consciously cultivate a positive emotional state, especially on such a potent day. This is exactly why I've created a video on the seven things you must avoid on 11 11ths to ensure you don't block your manifestations. You can find the link to that video in the pinned comment, so be sure to check it out. But right now, I want to share with you a powerful ritual designed specifically for this day to help you enter a high vibrational state. When you're in this state, everything you think, feel, and wish for is infused with the energy of having already achieved it. That intention will then travel out into the universe, and before you know it, your desires will be materializing in your physical reality at an incredibly fast pace. Let's dive into the ritual. There are three steps in this ritual, and you can do it anytime during the day or night, but it'd be great if you can do it at 11 11 a.m. or 11 11 p.m. The first step is conscious breathing meditation for five minutes, and let me explain why. A peaceful mind under conscious breathing slows down the respiratory rate, sometimes even below the normal level. This practice typically entails deep intentional breathing, where one becomes fully aware of each breath's rhythm, depth, and the sensations it creates within the body. The purpose of conscious breathing is to ground oneself in the present moment and to heighten awareness. Close your eyes gently and bring your awareness toward your breathing. Inhale slowly and deeply. As you breathe in, feel and visualize the air passing through your nostrils, then the throat, and lastly filling your lungs fully with air. Now exhale slowly. As you breathe out, feel and visualize the air coming upwards from your lungs, through your throat, and lastly your nostrils, breathe out completely. Repeat this cycle for five minutes. By focusing on the breath, individuals can calm the mind, reduce stress, and create a deeper connection with their inner selves. It serves as a way to bring attention to the present moment, fostering a state of mindfulness that can aid in setting intentions and aligning oneself with the energies of the ritual. Deep intentional breathing encourages relaxation and clarity, allowing for a more profound spiritual experience during the ritual associated with the 1111 portal. It also helps you with the next steps of the ritual. The second step is to grab a paper and write down the 11 things you're genuinely grateful for. This could be the things you already have or a relationship or any basic needs that you have in your life. You have to bring a genuine feeling of gratitude from inside as you write it on the paper. Feeling is also a channel that connects you with the universe very fast. Gratitude is the fastest way to raise your vibration so that you can attract the life of your dreams. When you express gratitude, the divine responds saying, I'm pleased you appreciate it. I'll send you even more. In fact, I think you'll like this even more. The more gratitude you have, the more abundance you attract. Gratitude helps you to stay in a high vibrational state. When you're in a high vibrational state, you receive only high vibrational results into your physical reality. There's no other way. The third step is to begin writing down 11 things that you deeply wish to manifest in your life in the next 11 months. These could be goals, intentions, or desires. Whatever your heart truly longs for. Write it down in the present tense and feel as if you have already achieved it. As you write down these aspirations, 
It's recommended to frame them in positive and present tense affirmations. For example, instead of saying, I want to lose weight, you might phrase it as, I am achieving and maintaining my ideal weight and vibrant health. Again, the feeling is the secret here for faster manifestation. Writing down these desires with clarity and specificity is essential. By being clear about what you want to manifest, you're engaging in the process of visualization, which is a key component of manifestation practices. This clarity aids in focusing your mind and energy towards these goals. After making this list, revisiting it periodically throughout the 11 months can help reinforce your commitment to these goals. Taking actionable steps towards achieving these desires is equally important. Manifestation often involves not just visualization, but also active participation and effort towards your goals. The act of writing down your desires during this 1111 portal is thought to align your intentions with the heightened spiritual energy of the day, thus potentially amplifying the power of your intentions and enhancing the manifestation process. The focus on the number 11 and the specificity of 11 desires for the following 11 months is a structured and symbolic way of engaging with the spiritual energies and working towards your goals. Thank you for watching. I hope I helped you with something useful in this video. If you liked the video, please give a thumbs up and let me know in the comments. I'll see you in the next video.